guys, welcome back to Widow's Asset Forum and thanks for tuning in. As you can see, it's late at night at the end of August. I'm on my balcony and I'm trying to catch a glimpse of that full supermoon behind me. And also Saturn is in close proximity to that moon. But actually, that's not why I'm making this video. I'm making this video to say a heartfelt Thank you to all of you who subscribe to my channel and especially those of you who also joined my channel as an Astro Coffee supporter for $2.99 a month. And especially for those of you who joined the channel, I wanted to do something back and that little something has to do with the video clip that I'm about to show you right now. probably guess it already, I'm going to create some dedicated tutorial videos about astrophotography and I will start with the full-fledged planetary imaging course for those of you who joined my channel. So I will be giving different lectures on planetary imaging from the kind of gear you need all the way up to how to find and capture the planets in the night sky and how to process your raw data into nice final pictures you can share with your friends with your family and online. I'm going to tell you more about it, but first I'm going to take my zoom lens and I hope to zoom in on that moon over there that's breaking through the clouds. Okay, okay, I know what you're thinking. Is this guy really going to use PowerPoint slides? And actually I am. Maybe it's not the most exciting way, but it's one of the most efficient ways to give you all the information you need to get into planetary imaging yourself. Um, I'm working on this introduction lecture right now. I'll upload it today and hopefully this will get you excited to get out there and do some planetary imaging yourself. So I'm also going to talk about the best times and the best places to image the planets in the night sky. I'm going to show you different applications you can use on your smartphone and computer to actually also find the planets in the night sky. So in this course, we're also going to be talking about astro gear, of course. What types of telescopes, what kind of telescope mounts, and what kind of planetary cameras are best suited to engage in planetary imaging. At least that is when the skies are clear. So of course we're also going to be talking about software you can use to find and track the planets in the night sky, how to take videos and pictures of the planets and how to process those raw videos and pictures into a final sharpened image of a planet you're actually proud to share with your family, your friends or share online. 
so I will be uploading that first introduction lecture of the course about planetary imaging today. For those of you who joined the channel as an Astro Coffee supporter, you can expect more content in the upcoming weeks, uh, more lectures about planetary imaging, and also I'm going to share my raw data with you, so my pictures and my raw videos, so you can practice your processing skills, your planetary processing skills using my data. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for joining the channel. For those of you who subscribe to the channel but didn't join me yet, no, no worries, I will continue to put out lots of content about new astrophotography gear, new hardware, new software in the astrophotography world, world so don't worry about that. And um, hope to see you again in the next video. Clear skies. <laughs>